Welcome to Hallelujah Every Day. Thanks for connecting. I'm your friend and host, Pastor Leke Toba. From here, it's good morning. However, your time zone, God's word is alive and active. Expect your miracle today in Jesus' name. We take our reading of the Holy Bible from the book of Mark 11 verses 22 and 23. Bible says, have faith in God. Jesus answered, truly, I tell you, if anyone says to this mountain, go throw yourself into the sea and does not doubt in their heart, but believes that what they say will happen, it will be done for them. Hallelujah. Life was formed from the word of God's mouth. Genesis gives a clear picture of creation. Things that were not were called spoken into existence. Anything, child of God, that is in your life that you don't like, you can change. You don't have to tolerate and keep managing that situation. You need to know and understand that you have capacity and ability inside of you to change things. Your power to influence and transform things, even if it has a timing, you have a responsibility, which is to speak until the change manifests. God has given you an inherent and inherited capacity to create a change. Your father is the unchanging changer and you are the changing changer because the more you are being changed in his own image, the more the ability to change things begin to grow inside you. You are called to be a transformer, a changer. Bible says, Whatever you say to his hearing, that will he make happen for you. If there's something you don't like around you or in your life, start changing them by changing how you speak. Start speaking. The power to change things is in your mouth. Every change you ever saw God wrought on the earth started by speaking. The Bible says, and the earth was without form and void and the darkness was upon the face of the deep and the spirit of god moved upon the face of the waters all these changed nothing until god said let there be light that was when change came hallelujah heaven and earth are waiting to see what you will say demons and angels are waiting as well to carry out what you are saying what you are saying is greater and more powerful than what you are thinking manifestation only comes when it is spoken out what you say is what you get you must have heard preachers say a closed mouth is a closed destiny don't let anyone speaking negative things stay around you have a last say in your discussion Always cancel negative words and let your language be scriptural. Be bold to talk and change things with your mouth. If you keep your mouth long enough in the direction of change, you will have what you expect. Speak your way out of pain, out of sorrow. Speak health, speak fruitfulness, speak marital breakthrough, speak gainful employment. Keep saying it, don't stop. If the child or children are exhibiting strange behaviors speak the word of life into their spirit recalibrate their frequency with the word of life in your mouth that mouth was not designed to be quiet it was designed to speak and to speak life bible says life and death are in the power of the tongue whatever you speak against will flee from you remember your mouth is the tool for change I want you to take time and cancel every negative word you have spoken before and begin to confess positively into your life and around you. For those that are parents, call your children. Call them forward before you. Lay your hands on their head and begin to speak positive. Prophesy to their head. Bless their present. Bless their future. Never underestimate that change power on your tongue. Husbands, speak into the life of your wife likewise wife speak into the life of your husband whatsoever the situation you want speak it out hear me whatever the situation may be you must address it by name now i speak into your life 
you are blessed you are celebrated you are for signs and wonders you are fruitful you are healed you are for testimonies you are for open doors and advancement your children are for signs and for wonders you will not see shame whoever is secretly putting embargo on your progress i speak destruction upon them witchcraft and marine agenda over your life be destroyed in jesus name you will not be disappointed in the name of the father the son and the holy spirit can your amen roar better than thunder amen thanks for connecting with us today before we say goodbye i pray specially for all those having wedding anniversary and birthday today your joy will exceed and overflow with blessings and grace in the name of jesus by this time next year it will be a bigger and exceeding load of testimonies laughter and blessings in the mighty name of jesus connect with our daily podcast on whatsapp plus two three four eight zero six seven zero one three six six four and plus two three four eight zero two three three one nine four three six you can link up with pastor Lake toba and hallelujah every day on facebook youtube instagram apple podcast spotify google podcast or follow my hashtag pastor Lake toba i would love to get feedback from you see you tomorrow god willing and remember there are miracles for you every day in jesus name amen